Hello and Sawadee Kap. This is Teacher Ray again from ACS MLP. MLP stands for the Modern Language Program. It was founded in 2004. Now we have grades 1 to grades 11. Last year we opened grade 10. Now we have grade 11. Next year we will open for grade 12. If you want to find out more about ACS MLP, please visit us here in ACS. Previously in my videos, you learned how to log in and log out, how to find your subjects in the dashboard and my courses, and how to access your activities in the events so you can learn how to prioritize, do what's necessary first, and do what can be done later. Today in this video, you will learn how to access your subject and find your lessons. Let's do it together. But first, access your website using your username and your password. How do you do that? Again, your username is your ID number. ACS, an ID number. And password, your ID number. Are you logged in already? Now, when you're on the website, click on the dashboard. This is your dashboard. There you go. And you see all the subjects, the colored icons. Choose any of the subjects. I choose science. It's my favorite subject. And when I enter my subject, I see all these things. What are these things? When you enter your subject, you will see your lecture, your assignment or your homework, exercises, and quiz. Now, these things can be accessed in your phone and your tablet as well. So if you don't have a computer, or while you're at the mall, at a restaurant, or even in your toilet. You can even learn in there. All you have to do is just click on the subject and you will find your lessons. Now, I'm in my subject. I see here an instruction coming from the teacher. It says here, week number one. For your lesson in week one, Read the attached document, watch the video, and perform the activity. Now, here is the video, and your lecture is right down below. Because the instruction says, read the lecture first. Please, read the lecture first. I will read my lecture, but I can't find it here. All I see is sample lecture, the words. Where do I find my lecture? Simple. Learning by clicking. Click the document. And it will automatically open. Now here's one thing. If the file is a PDF, when you click on the document, it will automatically open on your screen. It's a PDF form. But if a file is in Microsoft Word format, your computer will automatically download the file so that you can work on the exercise at home using your computer. Do you have to submit your exercise? It depends on the teacher. You may submit the exercise online or when you come back to school or you can simply just answer it so you can practice how far you've learned so far. After you're done with the lecture, you proceed with the next activity. Let's go back to the subject. The instruction was, read the attached document. I'm done with that. Watch the video. Where is the video? It's right here. It's embedded on the page. Click the video. 
and it will automatically open. There you go, it's that easy, right? When you're done with the video, proceed to your activities. What are your activities? It can be an exercise, it can be a homework or assignment, or it can be a quiz. It depends on your teacher. Now, aside from the lectures, your teacher might add an interactive game on the subject. All you have to do is just click. And you see, the game starts right away. Let's have an example. 2 times 6, that's 12. Oh, where's 12? All you have to do is click. If you get it correctly, you hear that sound. Let's say 2 times 1, it's 2. You see that sound? You hear that sound? Next. 1 times 6. What if you make a mistake? You press 0. It makes a different sound. And then you have your quiz here. Now that you've learned how to access your lectures and other activities in your subject, in the next video I will teach you how to do your quiz and answer your assignments. This is Teacher Ray and Sawadee Kapu.